Your local weather authority, always watching and tracking for you from the JES Weather Center. And we'll keep you in the New River Valley for today's picture of the day. Nice, comfortable evening yesterday. Timothy took advantage of that to take in this view in Draper. Timothy, thank you very much for sending this to us via Pinnet. That's the best way to get your picture shown on Virginia today. Head over to our app. There's a little camera icon where you can make yourself a profile. All the cool kids are doing it, just like Timothy in Pulaski County. Speaking of cool kids, as we're heading out on the bus stop this morning, it is a little bit on the cool side this morning. Upper 50s and lower 60s at about 6 or 7 o'clock. Heading toward 10 o'clock this morning, we're nice and comfortable in the low to mid 70s. Roanoke today, 87. Pulaski, 82. Alta Vista at about 88. Rocky Mountain Covington at about 85. Fast forward to tomorrow, maybe a stray mountain shower. Otherwise, the temperatures don't change all that much. Bedford, Lexington, 86. Danville, 87. You flip that around for Hillsville, you got 78 as your forecast high. Comfortable humidity today. We'll call it tolerable tomorrow. Comes up ever so slightly. Then Sunday is definitely looking and feeling more humid. Here's the reason for that. You've got low pressure off toward the west. You've got high pressure toward the east. Both of those things are going to bring in the moisture so turning more humid by Sunday but storm chances rise into Labor Day so I think they'll be scattered Sunday and then more numerous heading into Labor Day as low pressure uh, is going to be a little bit closer to us by then. Meanwhile, in the tropics, tropical storm Danielle formed in the North Atlantic yesterday. No shot of that making it here. Then near the Caribbean, there's a 70% chance of development. That's the red X that you see on the right hand side and near Africa, a 10% chance of development. So uh, we may get the E storm Earl here within the next few days. Otherwise, not much beyond that in the New River Valley. Don't have to worry about the tropics, but we are going to be dodging scattered showers and storms Sunday and Monday. That's going to take temperatures back a little bit. Highs only between about 76 and 78 from Sunday through next week. As I said last half hour, the percentages you see here for Tuesday through Thursday, they're probably going to change. We have to see where exactly that area of low pressure is going to go, and sometimes that's hard to tell five to seven days out. Roanoke Valley 87 today and tomorrow Sunday 83. Labor Day, more clouds and more numerous showers, upper 70s and lower 80s. We'll keep it in the upper 70s and lower 80s for daytime highs heading into the middle of next week. But as much as we've enjoyed a little bit of a break from the humidity, it is on the way back. One way to tell that is in the extended forecast overnight lows at the bottom of your screen between 64 and 68.